Love Restored. Hey everyone, and welcome to Soulmaker. Today's story is one of loss, resilience, and the incredible power of love. It's a story that proves even in the darkest times, hope can bloom and families can be reunited. So grab your tissues, settle in, and let's begin. A Shadow Cast. At just 16, our protagonist finds herself facing an unwanted pregnancy. Shame and societal pressures lead her mother to send her away to a home for unwed mothers in Nebraska. There, amidst cold stares and strict rules, she navigates a world that offers no choice but adoption. This young woman, brimming with love for her unborn child, feels her spirit slowly withering under the weight of forced surrender. A glimmer of hope. A glimmer of hope arrives in the form of a temporary home with a kind family. Here, she can care for their children, finding purpose and a sliver of happiness. In the quiet moments, she whispers promises to her baby, dreaming of a future that seems increasingly out of reach. The painful farewell. The day of labor arrives, filled with fear and uncertainty. Dehumanizing treatment from medical staff fuels her despair as she's forced to sign papers, relinquishing all rights to her child. A heartbreaking glimpse through the nursery window is all she gets before they tear her daughter away. The pain cuts deep, leaving an emotional scar that forever alters her course. Living in limbo. Years pass, each one a silent testament to her loss. Unable to face her family or embrace new beginnings, she becomes a ghost of her former self. Work becomes her refuge, a distraction from the void in her heart. The laughter and dreams of youth are replaced by a hollow existence, yearning for what could have been. A call from the past. Then, in 1994, a phone call pierces the silence. The Nebraska Children's Home holds a bombshell. Her daughter, now a grown woman, wants to meet her. A wave of emotions washes over her, shock, fear, hope, and an overwhelming desire to reconnect. This unexpected lifeline offers a chance to rewrite the narrative, to heal, and perhaps, find redemption. The Reunion. The Reunion. The first meeting is a whirlwind of tears, laughter, and nervous energy. As they share stories and fill in the gaps of their separate journeys, a powerful bond begins to form. The daughter, named Stacy, expresses gratitude for the life she's had while acknowledging the sacrifice her mother made. It's a moment of profound healing, forgiveness, and the blossoming of a mother-daughter connection decades in the making. Embracing the present. Years later, Stacy welcomes her own child, and our protagonist gets the chance to hold her grandchild. Experiencing the love she once thought lost. It's a beautiful symbol of the circle of life, a testament to the enduring power of love. And a reminder that even in the darkest moments, hope can prevail. Love's Legacy. Our protagonist's story is one of resilience, courage, and ultimately, love's triumphant return. It reminds us that mistakes can be forgiven, wounds can heal, and families can be formed in unexpected ways. As we close the book on this chapter, let's hold onto the message that love, in its purest form, can transcend barriers in time, forever binding hearts together. Soul fam, this is just one powerful example of how love can defy all odds. Share your thoughts and feelings in the comments below. Did this story resonate with you? Have you experienced similar challenges or reunions? Remember to like this video, subscribe to the channel for more inspiring stories, and let me know if you'd like a deeper dive into this particular tale. Until next time, keep believing in the power of love.